Hi everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer and today we are looking at our Hopkins rear windshield sunscreen here at eTrailer. Now we're going to take a closer look at the pop-up window shade. So this is going to help filter out that heat and that glare. You can see the difference against my arm where it's behind the screen. It will help keep it a little bit cooler inside your vehicle, especially when you're out and about and your rear passengers would appreciate that reduction of that heat. So the inside of the shade is made of a high density polyester mesh. So that mesh needs to be tightly woven to be more effective. On the edge you have this 170 thread count polyester edging and it's an okay design. It would be nice if it was double hemmed but this way you don't have to worry as much about fraying and it's a nice comfortable edging. Now as for the dimensions, these are very important because this will help determine if it fits with your vehicle. So for the length, it is 39 inches and 3 8 of an inch long. And width wise, it is 19 and a quarter inches tall. And when you don't want your pop-up windscreen up, you can fold this down. So just hold it at each end and then twist inwards. And this will make it a lot smaller and a lot easier to store. Now this does say one size fits all, but it does depend on your windshield. So please make sure that you have a large enough windshield to use this. This uses four suction cups in each quarter to mount this to your windshield. And let's take a look at that process. Before installing, what you need to do first is to make sure your rear windshield is clean. Now the important part is on the inside, but I also clean the outside just to make sure. After wiping the inside of your windshield with a damp cloth, use that same damp cloth to wipe the suction cups as well. Once everything has been wiped down, you then put up your windscreen cover. And now you can see how this covers our rear windshield. This will help filter out that heat as well as that glare there in the back. So my final thoughts about this rear windshield is, well, for one, you have to make sure this fits your vehicles. Some of them have smaller windshields nowadays, so if it is too small, this isn't gonna be a good fit. But if you have a larger windshield, this is a good addition to your vehicle setup because this will reduce that heat and make it a little bit more comfortable for your backseat passengers. Now the vacuum cups can be a little bit tricky, especially when it's extra hot. So make sure to wipe down everything and make sure that you have a good seal around that vacuum. But once that is good, then you're good and it, it works pretty well. And that was a look at our Hopkins rear windshield sunscreen here at eTrailer. My name is Evangeline and I hope you enjoyed the journey.